Okay, good day everyone. Now, we are in the top producing regions in the country. And it is Agriculturist Licensure Examination for Crop Science. And as of 2020, there are 17 regions in the country. And this was taken from the Philippine Statistics Authority from the book 2015 to 2019, Crops is Statistics of the Philippines. Now let's go to the cereals, which composting, rice, and corn. Central Luzon, or the Region 3, is the top producing region for rice. During the five-year period from 2015 to 2019, Central Luzon was consistently the top producer of rice, with 3.73 million tons or 19.8% of the country's rice output in 2019. Central Luzon had the largest share in terms of area harvested for palay or rice at 15.7% of the 4.66 million hectares area harvested. And for the corn, Cagayan Valley or the Region 2 with Batanes, Cagayan, Isabela, Nueva Vizcaya, and Quirino provinces which corn production in 2019 was 2.7% higher compared with the 2018 level of 7.77 million metric tons. Cagayan Valley continued to be the top producer of corn in 2019 with 1.87 million metric tons, which shared 23.4% to the total corn production. And now let's go to the fruit crops. First is the banana. Davao region or the region 11 with the provinces from Davao de Oro, Davao del Norte, Davao del Sur, Davao Occidental, and Davao Oriental, which is the biggest producer of banana. Recorded 3.43 million metric tons or 37.4% to the total banana production in 2019. This was followed by the Northern Mindanao, Saksarjan, and Barm with 21.4, 12.9, and 6.5% shares, respectively. Second commodity is Calamansi. It is from the Region 4B or the Memaropa with Occidental and Oriental Mindoro, Marinduque, Romblon, and Palawan provinces. Memaropa region remained as the top producer of calamansi with 52.81 thousand metric tons or 41.9 percent share to the total calamansi production in 2019. Calaburzon came next with 13.03 thousand metric tons or 10.3 percent share. For the third commodity or the fruit is mango. Ilocos region Ilocos Norte, Ilocos Sur, La Union, and Pangasinan provinces was the top producer for mango with production of 178.54 thousand metric tons or 24.2% share to the country's total output in 2019. And this was followed by Central Visayas and Zamboanga Peninsula with a combined shares of 21.3%. Fruit is pineapple. This comes uh, from Region 10, which is the Northern Mindanao, which uh, the provinces are Bukidnon, Kamigin, Lanao del Norte, Misamis Occidental, and Misamis Oriental. And during the five year period, again from 2015 to 2019, Northern Mindanao consistently contributed more than half to the country's total pineapple production. So in 2019, Northern Mindanao produced 1.58 million metric tons of pineapple, which was 57.6% of the total output. So Saksarjan came next with 0.81 million metric tons or 29.5% share. And now let's go to the non-food and industrial crops. First, we have abaca. Region 5, or the Bicol region, remained as the top abaca producer in the country, 
with 28.94 thousand metric tons or 40.1% contribution to the total abaca production in 2019. And this was followed by Eastern Visayas and Davao region with 17.5% and 12.5% shares respectively. Also, Bicol region had the largest area planted for abaca with 43.16 thousand hectares in 2019. Bicol region has five, uh, six, with six provinces, Albay, Camarines Norte, Camarines Sur, Catanduanes, Masbate, and Sorsogon. For the second commodity, which is the coconut. Coconut is um, being produced top in Davao region. Again, in region 11, so in 2019, Davao region topped all other coconut producing regions with 1.93 million metric tons or 13.1% share to the total production. And this was followed by Northern Mindanao and Sambonga Peninsula with 12.4 and 11.8% 11 11 shares respectively. Third commodity is the coffee. Region 12 are the Saksargen, the South Cotabato, the North Cotabato or the Cotabato alone, the Sultan Kudarat, the Sarangani, and the General Santos remained as the top coffee producer with 20.56 thousand metric tons output or 34.2% share to the total production in 2019. Fourth one is the rubber. Region 9 or the Zamboanga Peninsula region was consistently the top producing region with production of 161.83 thousand metric tons or 37.5% shares to the country's total production in 2019. Region 9 has three provinces, Zamboanga del Norte, Zamboanga del Sur, and Zamboanga Zibugay. For the fifth one, we have sugarcane, and it was being produced consistently as a top producer from the Western Visayas or the Region 6 with seven provinces, the Aklan, Antique, Guimaras, Capiz, Iloilo, and Negros Occidental, which generated 12.64 million metric tons or 61.0% or 61% of the total production. For the sixth, we have Tobacco. Ilocos region or the region 1 remained the top producer of tobacco in 2019 with 34.38 thousand metric tons or 67.3% contribution to the country's total production of tobacco. And now let's move on to the vegetable and root crops. First we have cabbage. Cordillera administrative region or the car region remained the leading producer of cabbage with 100.50 thousand metric tons or 78.5% share to the country's total output in 2019, which CAR or the Cordillera Administrative Region has have six provinces, the Abra, Apayao, Binguet, Ifugao, Kalinga, and Mountain Province. For the second one, we have cassava which is a BARM, or the Bangsang Moro Autonomous Region in Muslim Mindanao, registered the highest production of cassava with 1,062.73 thousand metric tons, contributing 40.4% to the total output in 2019. And BARM, consisting five provinces, Basilan, Lano del Sur, Maguindanao, Sulu, and Tawi-Tawi. For the third one, we have eggplant. So Ilocos region, or the region 1 again, is the top producer of their eggplant with 99.19 thousand metric tons, contributed 39.7% to the total output in 2019. Again from Ilocos region, we have peanut, posted the highest reduction of peanut at 11.91 thousand metric tons, or 40.7% of the total output in 2019. The fifth one, again, from Region 1, the Ilocos region, which is the tomato, 
registered the biggest production of 73.32 metric tons or 32.8% of total output in 2019. And another is garlic. Ilocos region has the major is the major producer of garlic with 4.82 thousand metric tons, shared 66.5% of the total output in 2019. And for the central Luzon, the region 3 for the commodity onion. Central Luzon top all the onion producing regions with production of 138.80 thousand metric tons, which accounted for 62.5% of the total output in 2019. Eight is the sweet potato. It is coming from the region eight, the eastern Visayas, with uh, these far provinces: Biliran, Eastern Samar, Leyte, Northern Samar, Samar, and Southern Leyte. Eastern Visayas is the major was the major producer of sweet potato with ninety eight point ninety five thousand metric tons, shared. 18.8% of the total output in 2019. And that's all for today. Thank you for watching and subscribe and like and hit the notification bell. Thank you.